Hey YouTube, welcome back. How is everyone? You've been here before. You know the drill. Let's run the things. First things first, make sure you're subscribed to this channel. Hit the button, turn on the bell so you know when I upload here. I try to be as consistent as I can, but it's not always perfect. If you would like to see full-length reactions to these wonderful Buffy episodes, you can do so via my Patreon, which is linked down below in the description, along with the link to my main channel where I watch a bunch of other stuff, so you can subscribe to me over there too. And last but certainly not least, leave a comment down below so that I can chat with you all, but no spoilers. That's it. Onto the other me. Okay, I think that this two-parter is probably going to be about them figuring out Spike and Dee are alive. Well, like alive, you get it. So I was like pretty, I was like, okay, it's going to be exciting. It's worth like a two-parter, but I don't think anything bad's going to happen. And then I started getting ready and I was like, something bad's going to happen. <laughs> but I don't know what it is. I was kind of like debating back and forth in my head. I'm like, maybe like one of them would die, but I feel like they're not going to die yet. Like they're just establishing them as kind of people, people, villain, whatever, villains, vampires that I kind of feel like might stick around for a little bit. They might be like the end of season two death thing, but then ugh, I was like, maybe one of them will die. I don't know. I don't know, but something's going to happen. All right. So um, that should set the stage for where I'm at. You know what though? Okay, wait, one, one last note just from the last episode. I was laughing when I was editing because I didn't realize that like the, um, the cowboys, that's what else I wanted to say. Maybe that we'll see that cowboy guy again, but I was laughing when I was editing last episode because I didn't realize that they like, they know Angel by name. Like, does everybody just know Angel? Like, bad Angel, but everybody just, like, knows Angel. He's just, like, Mr. Popular, I guess. <laughs> but it kind of got me thinking. I'm like, do they know he doesn't, or that, like, he's good, that he has, like, a soul? Like, I don't know how vampire gossip works, but did, did that not travel around? <laughs> I don't know. That was my only thought from like last episode. But yeah, maybe we'll see the cowboy. I'm just, I just want to see Drusilla, obviously. I've been asking. So I'm pretty certain my wish is going to come true. I'm going to see Drusilla. She's going to be strong. Oh my God, what if she fights Buffy? <laughs> oh, I kind of want to see it. Sip first. Thank you. I couldn't see anything. Oh. Oh, we're dreaming. <laughs> My heart just started pounding. I'm like, okay, let's start off with the Buffy D fight. That would have, oh my God. Okay, we're dreaming though. What's up? Where's my monkey? Do you really think you're ready, Buffy? I don't know. Ready for what? <laughs> this dream is going on too long. Angel, that looks like a smile for Angel. <laughs> This is a dream, but that was still kind of cool. Birthday, it's her birthday? Fun! Oh man, if I'd have known, could have made cake. I hope that when we actually see Drusilla, she's like wearing something similar to that because I like the black <laughs> a lot. <laughs> You're okay, right? I'm fine. I've had those dreams though where you have to call people. <laughs> Be like, everything good? Not every dream you have comes true. I mean, what else did you dream last night? There was a monkey. Bows and I opened an office supply warehouse in Vegas. Oh, come on, I want to see that dream. We never saw her body. But what if she is? But you didn't see her body. That is true. And we've had talks about thoroughness in the past with this little crew. I'm sorry, I, um, I, I have to go to school. She had time to go to his house before school. Like, I woke up last minute. Like, it took me 10 minutes to get to school, so I would wake up, like, half an hour before school started. <laughs> Brush my teeth, make coffee, throw my hair in a bun, grab a hoodie, go. Like, I was cutting it close all the time. I didn't have time to go visit no one before school. I like you at bedtime. You actually said that? I know, I know. <laughs> well, what am I going to do? What do you want to do? <laughs> I don't know. That's such a good way to answer that question. Once you get to a certain point, this season is sort of inevitable. Wow. True. Yeah. He's a vampire, though. How does that work? Don't answer that. Never mind. 
You think he's too old because he's a senior? Please, my boyfriend had a bicentennial. That's true. <laughs> See, our band's kind of moving towards this new sound where we suck, so practice. I think you guys sound good. <laughs> Thanks. I like your earring. Psst, earrings. I'm going to ask you to go out with me tomorrow night. <laughs> and kind of nervous about it, actually. Oh, It'll be okay. Well, if it helps at all, I'm going to say yes. <laughs> yeah, it helps. It, it creates a comfort zone. Do you want to go out with me tomorrow night? Oh, I can't. <laughs> well, see, I like that you're unpredictable. Hey, it's just it's Buffy's birthday. And we're oh, having right. our surprise party. <gasps> Yay. Well, you could be my date. All right, I'm in. Oh, yay. I'm so happy. Surprise party sounds fun, though. Manana. Are you guys going to go together? Well, I'm Chips and Dips girl. Oh, horrors. <laughs> All that opening and stirring. And shopping and carrying. You can cook dips. You ever made a spinach dip in your life, Xander? We maybe go? Why? I don't know. It's... Well, of course you want to tell everybody. You have nothing to be ashamed of. I, on the other hand, have everything to be ashamed of. You know what? Enough said. Oh, Are we gonna see gal? I don't like this. It's too much happiness. Which I mean is great. We love happiness, but I just feel like can we get to the part where bad things are gonna happen? I don't want to get too high up here just to crash and burn, you know what I mean? Let's party. I don't know. I don't want to start a big freak out over nothing. Still, best to be uh, on the alert. Cautious, yep. Again, so many words. Couldn't you just say we'd be in trouble? Go to class, Ellen. I should keep my slayer cool, but... It's Angel, which automatically equals Maxi Wig. Listen to your gut. These guys telling you it's nothing, you know better. You know. Listen to your gut. It's just I've had it in this place. Nothing ever comes off like it's supposed to. My gatherings are always perfect. We're gonna crash the party. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is so odd. Like, so... Weird, but I like it. It's swapped and I like it. I like her in red. She looks great. I mean, I don't necessarily like that like Spike is now weakened, but I mean, I like that we get to see a period of time where they're swapped a little bit because I'm sure he'll probably become strong again eventually. But both of them strong together at the same time would be great to have eventually. But I do like this. This is interesting. I kind of hope, are we going to crash the party? Oh, that sucks for Buffy, but like, it's kind of just exciting to watch. I can't abide them. <laughs> Let's try something different with the flowers then. Yeah, get them right. Fuck. <laughs> Before the party. No, I want to see. Okay, good. We get to see. Do you like it, baby? It reeks of death. It will feed them love. Wait, what? What'd you say? What'd you say? I need you to speak up. It will feed them love. You know, I woke up feeling more responsible, mature, and level headed. Really? <laughs> what a difference a day can make. You said we could talk about it again when I was 17. Do you really think you're ready, Buffy? Down to the day. Oh shit, things are coming true from her dream. Is she gonna figure it out before the party? Or are we gonna get to the crashing of the party? What? Who are you? Don't you touch her. Jenny Calendar. I cannot imagine what is so important to make you ignore the responsibility to your people. The curse still holds. The elder woman is never wrong. She says his pain is lessening. She can feel it. Who's? How could you let this happen? I promise you, Angel still suffers. And he makes amends for his evil. He even saved my life. That he killed every man, woman, and child that touched her life? Vengeance demands that his pain be eternal as ours is. One minute of happiness, it is one minute too much. What, you thought you are Jenny Calendar now? Yeah, you're being a little rude. <laughs> Uncle, I know. Do what you must to take her from him. I will see to it. And then my mom broke the plate. There's a lot of information that just happened there. 
Sorry, I'm just, I'm just digesting. Cal, what the hell? Okay, I need to talk this out. <laughs> okay, so she, it's her family that cursed him. Okay, so she, he, he, because he, he, angel, bad angel, killed her family. I have to rewatch that whole speech, but I'll just cut it out or put it in double. Okay, so this is what I'm gathering. I want to fact check myself though. So like, okay, so (laughs) I can't talk. Angel killed her family. They cursed him and she has to make sure that he stays cursed and now he's getting too happy because he's in love and so that means the curse is going to go away. You know what? I never put any thought into this soul, did I? I just... It can go away? It can go away? No. Okay, whatever. I'm sorry. We're going back. I need to just hear every... Because he... His family... Her family cursed Angel. (laughs) Fuck. I've been working and... She's been busy. Something is different. Nothing has changed. The curse still holds. The elder woman is never wrong. She says his pain is lessening. She can feel it. The girl. What? How could you let this happen? I promise you, Angel still suffers. And he makes amends for his evil. He even saved my life. So you just forget that he killed every man, woman, and child that touched her life? Vengeance demands that his pain be eternal as ours is. If this this girl gives him one minute of happiness, it is one minute too much. I will see to it. Okay, okay. I think I got that all right. Angel killed her family, so her family wants to make sure he lives in agony with his soul but now he's becoming too happy so he's not hurting anymore so she has to like break them up one minute of happiness is too many i know we're gonna find all this out but i'm just like <laughs> i just need to know now because the soul can't no it's a it's just a curse i guess it can so she needs to like break them up make sure he's not too happy or Yeah, I don't know what else. <laughs> but, like, is she going to tell Roop who she is? Because, like, there's that. She probably can't because he would have to, he would want to and or have to tell Buffy. And I think Buffy would be pissed. <laughs> oh, sorry. I That was just too much information. She's not bad, though, right? Like, she's just, I mean, she kind of lied to me specifically. We'll talk about that later, Calzone. I, like, I get it, but. She didn't have to lie to me, you know? Of all people. Her biggest fan. Okay, let's move on. How's she gonna break them up? I don't know. My mom broke the plate. It was just like my dream. Every gesture, every word. It was so creepy. Yes, well, I'd imagine it would be. My brain's gonna be stuck on that. Fuck. Just in my dream, I couldn't stop her. She blindsided me. Angel was gone before I knew what happened. Even if she is alive, we can still protect Angel. Okay, so fine, we're one step ahead, but I want to stay that way. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Let me read up on Drusilla, uh, see if she has any particular patterns. What am I supposed to do until then? Go to classes, do your homework, have supper. He's going to use that as the way to get her there for the surprise? I hope you actually look into it, though, Rupe. So much for our surprise party. Oh, no, 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 let's still have the party. No, you won't. cake. We're having a party tonight. Mm -hmm. Looks like Mr. Caution Man, but the sound he makes is funny. (laughs) <laughs> Life is a surprise party will go ahead as we plan. One thing I've learned in my tenure here on the Hellmouth is that there is no good time to relax. But Buffy's turning 17 just this once and she deserves a party. You're a great man of our time. That is sweet. Angel's coming, so she'll be able to protect him and have cake. God, I want cake. <laughs> That's all I can think about now. Because they're going to have such a nice cake. Buffy. I thought it would be chocolate. Oh my God, I didn't oh, see that. Sorry. Giles wanted me to tell you that there's been a change of plans. Uh, he wants to meet you someplace near his house. I guess he had to run home and get a book or something. What's her plan? Mm-hmm. Um, you know, my car's here. Why don't I drive you? What's her plan? No. You can't hurt Buffy. Every time I see you, you're stealing something. <laughs> I 
find you. Headbutt, back headbutt, nice. What's the plan? I'm too anxious. She's not gonna hurt Duffy, is she? She's like, because she, she likes being Miss Cow, I think. I know nothing anymore. Everything I know is a lie. <laughs> sums it up oh my god oz is here surprise party <laughs> happy birthday that is so sweet sure you're okay yes i'm fine are you okay <laughs> yeah hey did everybody see that guy just turn to dust <laughs> vampires are real a lot of them live in sunnydale we'll go through the end I know it's hard to accept at first. Actually, it explains a lot. <laughs> I'm sorry, I like that so much. I was like, oh shit, Oz is here. But you know what? It's probably just best. Rip the bandaid off. It would have been too hard to keep a secret anyway. But like, our circle's getting a little big. We should chill on who we tell, right? I don't know. What is it? I have no idea. Oh, I want to see cut, what's cut in there. Up. Open it up. Or maybe don't. <coughs> what was that? It looked like an arm. <laughs> Can't be. She wouldn't. What, uh, Vamp's version of snakes in a can, or do you care to share? Yeah, tell me. Separate the righteous from the wicked, and then burn the righteous down. This is Heath? Not all of them. Part, yeah. Um, still any backstory here? Um, he, he, he couldn't be killed, yes? Pieces were scattered, buried in every corner of the earth. So all these parts are being brought here. By Drusilla. The vamps outside were Spike's men. Is anybody else gonna have cake? We need to get this out of town. I can't fly. There's no sure way to guard against the daylight. I don't like this any more than you do, Buffy. There's no other choice. So she's just gonna, she just wants them separated and then he'll be sad. And that's good enough. I'll drive you to the docks. <laughs> Give us a minute, Cal. You lost it. Okay. Okay. That's not a bad plan. I was way too scared. I was thinking she was like gonna try and like something immaculate and like make them break up. But th I guess this way, this like him leaving is really only temporary. But he'd be sad, so then it would be better. He wouldn't be happy. Is the idea here? You know, I just feel like that's too easy. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> but it's a good idea. No one has to get hurt. That's why it feels too easy. Cool though, but the judge. That's kind of cool, right? He's just like in little pieces, and they're all working. Like, they're workable pieces. So, like, together. Cool. Cool. You lost my present. I know. You did. You did. I'm sorry. <laughs> you might give him a chance to find your lost treasure. He is a wanker, but he's the only one we've got with half a brain. If he fails, you can eat his eyes out of the sockets for all I care. I'll get it. Do it. <laughs> okay. Might need new ones. Hurry back then. Six months, a year. You don't know how long it's gonna take, or if we'll even. Well, if you haven't noticed, someone pretty much always wants us dead. Don't say that. We'll be fine. It's true, though. I have something for you. For your birthday, I Present? I mean, I know it's a ring, but like... Before I was changed, they exchanged this as a sign of devotion. Oh, that's kind of nice. And a heart. <laughs> you know. Love. <laughs>
shit with the box, but I can't get the box. They should be back by now. They're swimming. <laughs> Charles, what do we know? The more I study the judge, the less I like him. His touch can literally burn the humanity out of you. Time. Better do a round robin. Xander, you go first. Good call. Round robin? It's when everybody calls everybody else's mom and tells them they're staying at everyone's house. Spring <laughs> is up for world savage. And all my keggers. What, only Xander gets to make dumb jokes? Ma, <laughs> hi. Oh, no, I'm all nervous because the book... I'm not even nervous about the judge. I'm nervous about Cal. Because I know we'll take the judge on. <laughs> well, actually, I don't. But I just I feel like we will. And what I don't know about Cal. Because, like, she's on our side, right? Like, she doesn't want to hurt anybody. And if anyone, she'd probably want to hurt Angel. The plan to separate them didn't work. Like, could she just, she, couldn't she just talk to them? <laughs> I guess not, but fuck. Okay. Stressed. My throat is a little dry. <laughs> Think it over how cool Oz was about all this. Gee, I'm over True. it. True. Seems Buffy needed some rest. Yeah, she hasn't been sleeping well, tossing and turning. She told me. Because of her dreams. Uh oh, here we go again. Okay. Should I find out about Cal through a dream? More music. Let's just still get kind of a little party. <laughs> Look what I have for you, Doc. We got him. We got all the pieces. Cool. He's perfect, my darling. A little stretch. Been a while. You two stink of humanity. <laughs> share affection and jealousy yeah what of it do i have to remind you that we're the ones who brought you here put him in his place no <laughs> sorry guy no so he made it a long time Angel and I go to the factory and do recon, figure out how far they've gotten assembling the judge. You guys check any places the boxes could be coming into town. Completed. Shipping yards, airports, anything. We need to stop them from getting all the boxes in one place. We're too late. Yes. What is it? Uh oh, can you smell? Shit. We gotta get out of here. Yeah, you guys weren't doing a good job of even trying to hide, though, to be fair. Like, you're just standing there like that? I only dreamed you'd come. <laughs> Leave her alone. Yeah, that'll work. And, like, no now say pretty, me. please. <laughs> there is no instead. Just first and second. And if you yeah. go first, you don't get to watch the Slayer die. do no, touch him! <laughs> He, like, gone already? That's not, that's it? Or maybe he's just under all the rubble. Those are nice pants. Come on, we need to get inside. Imagine <laughs> they slipped. <laughs> Yeah. <clears throat> You're shaking like a leaf. Cold. Let me get you something. You got some hot chocolate in there or something? Go away. <laughs> Just leave the room. No. 
Oh, the one, like, focus. Just on the cuts. It's already closed. You're fine. You almost went away today. <laughs> me, me too. I can't either. Well, that's not good. <laughs> Just kiss me. I'd like to know how this works. I... Uh oh. I feel like this is bad. <sighs> One minute of happiness is too much. Is that too much happiness? Probably. <laughs> There's no way though that the curse is gone. Was the lightning, was that like his soul leaving? Is that what the lightning, is that why he's screaming? But he's, no, because he's saying Buffy's name. So he's still, ah, can we stop it? Oh no, this, that's bad. That's bad if that, I'm sh there's no way. But the guy, he said, oh no, oh no, 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 that's not good at all. Oh, I want good things to happen to Buffy. Can we stop with the bad? <laughs> Maybe it's not that. I should just watch the next part, but I'm pretty sure he is bad. How do we get it back? How do we get the soul back? Does he just have to be, no. Does he have to be recursed? Or would he just have to like, get his heart broken? <laughs> She could dump him and he could be like sad because then he's suffering. Oh my God, I'm losing my mind because I'm like, there's literally still a little part of me that is like, is it fully done? Is this a done deal? There's no way we're going to see him soulless. I mean, like, would he just kill her? I don't know what to do. <laughs> okay, well, instead of sitting in agony, <laughs> I'm going to go get a new coffee and we're just going to go into part two, but... There's no way. I'm just going to sit in denial for a little bit. <laughs> if y'all don't mind. Can Cal re-give him his soul? How does this soul thing work? I didn't fucking- I can't believe I did not think about this further. I just was like, okay, he's good. That's good. So then what's part two going to be? Because, okay, so we- now we know they're alive. What's part two going to be? Getting Angel his soul back, probably. If he actually lost it. I don't know. Okay. Part two. We, I just gotta, let's just get a good, good, good. So, um, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.